Gabby in the blue, Nicole in the white. Gabby and Nikki have history. They've uh, they battled yeah. at brown belt quite a few times. I believe Gabby typically uh, prevails. I'm not sure if Nikki's ever beat her, but uh, they've definitely fought two or three times. Gabby Lehiva. with the guard pull. Oh, yeah. And a quick sweep. Yeah, with Tomonagi. See, that's Gabby. Gabby knows that Nikki likes to be on bottom. Ah. Right, she pulled. It's just like when uh, Gustavo pulled on a uh, Good strategy. Right? Yep. You know, you take the guard away from the guard player. Here comes sneaking that foot in. Sullivan. <laughs> Gabby's heavy on top. Good wrestling, heavy passing, strong jiu-jitsu. Nikki's like kind of the opposite, like flexible, bendy, yeah. doesn't use a lot of power, likes to invert, likes to look for the legs. She needs to break off that grip on that side. That way she can get that left foot back into place or roll upside down. She's got to get some separation between her and Gabby. There she goes. A bit of distance now. I really like it when people lasso and De La Hiva on the same side. Yeah. You know, that, yeah. that seems like a really solid. I, I thought Nikki was going to set that up just now. Um, she's gotten herself into a. She still has a lasso, yeah. but yeah, it looks like Gabby's. Uh, there's a foot in the lapel she has there, too, so that'll help. I very much enjoy watching these two fight each other. It's like definitely a clash of styles. It is, and it's it a clash of body types yeah, as well. They, they couldn't be more different. Very long and flexible versus very powerful and compact. Stacked, yeah. yeah. Ooh, Abby's got a little bit of an angle now. Yeah, she's under the leg and got the, the collar, huh? That's yep. It's tough. Sticks her head in the into the position. Yep. And Nikki's so flexible, man. He can she can literally insert that foot yep. anywhere. You can see anywhere, it anywhere, man. There it comes. It's like a it's like a tentacle, an octopus tentacle. Yep. You know, it doesn't matter where you are. That like, put that tentacle inside. She just got to get enough space now to get that right foot. So on think the inside. if she c if in this position here. Oh, never mind. She had that left leg inside. So yeah, she had the left yep. leg inside. <coughs> if you're somehow just joining us, welcome to the broadcast. You're here for the 2019. Oh, that was a knee in the face. Uh, Pans, we're live at the Brin Event Center, Irvine, California. We're underway with the women's finals. We're at the lightweight women's finals. That was upset of the day, I definitely, by definitely easy. with with the submission too, not not just the two points. Yeah, yeah, he finished them. But what's not the? We'll see low back in a few hours, in less than an hour probably. Nicole Sullivan here in the white, Gabby McComb in the blue. McComb up two zero right now. Six minutes left. Andre Galval in the corner of Nikki Sullivan. And I would assume Leticia. I can't see, but I think it's Leticia Hibero yeah, in the corner of Gabby. It's nice to see the new generation of black belts. So these, these, both these girls are first year black belts. Mm -hmm. I think maybe Gabby's second year. Um, this is definitely Nikki's first year at black belt. Ooh. Uh, I, I, I thought she was gonna she tip was going to tip her over. Yeah, but I thought so too. Maybe lost her grip in there, and now Gabby snuck in a hook. Uh huh. But she got her feet. Oh, she got only one foot hook in. All right. Gabby attacking the back. Got the half back control. I love the half back control. Great way to control the hips. And look, first thing Nikki did is clear that that half back control. Right. Push down on that second hook, so she can't throw it in. And her hips are free, so she's able to pick her hips up off the mat. Gotta be 
careful of the neck. But though. the problem is, yeah, when you defend the hooks, you're yep. not defending the choke. And it seems like Gabby's locked in on a choke. Yeah. Yep. And Nikki tapped. I, I couldn't see. Could you see? I couldn't see I it. I couldn't no. see if it was a rear naked or collar, but I think it was a great effort by Nikki Sullivan. Um, it was her first time in the finals of a IBJJF major. Sorry, middleweight. Lightweight. That was lightweight. 